Yo, what's going on guys? Patty here. I woke up today, man. Um, you guys can see it's 2.34 p.m. I woke up literally an hour ago. Um, and I didn't know they actually released this until like I checked my Twitter. But apparently they've uh, released Team of the Year. Not Team of the Year in the game, but uh, they basically released uh, nominees. Um, I'm going to be honest. I don't really know how this works. So we're going to be both going into this together. Um, I don't know really how this works. Obviously in previous years... Team of the Year, they used to release Team of the Year back in like March or uh, April, back in like NHL 19, 18, and 17. I think NHL 20 uh, was the first time they changed it. Um, I do think the Team of the Year is basically the best line in 2020. So this is the best line in 2020. Um, yeah, we'll read everything. Drop a like, subscribe, and uh, yeah, tell me what you guys think about this. Uh, again, we do not know when this is going to come out. So I know there's going to be people asking me when this is going to release. We don't know. But uh, they basically release all the nominees. What is Team of the Year? Each year, each sports, NHL selects six players, one at each position. So it's one at each position that we believe makes up the best line in hockey from that calendar year. Check out the nominees below. So again, these are all the nominees. Uh, again, I want you guys to make your own list. I want to see what you guys have to come up with. So make your own list of all these nominees, one at each position. So this is tough because we have Crosby, Kane, Kucherov, Marner, Mc, uh, not McKinnon, Ranton, Zabinajad, Hoffman, Stone, Drysaddle, Connor, Ben, Pedersen, Kumbalik, Pashnak, Panarin, Matthews, Ovechkin. Um, I'm gonna be real. Did I miss Nathan McKinnon? Like, is Nathan McKinnon not here? Because if I mean that's that's crazy if there's no Nathan McKinnon. But all right, so from this list, I think guaranteed locks. Um, I don't know. For me personally, I don't think Matthews is gonna make it. I don't think Kumlik's gonna make it. Don't think Connor's gonna make it. Jane Ben, Pash, uh, not Pash, uh, Pedersen, Stone, Hoffman, um, Rantanen, and then Marner. It really, really depends on. I think the best line in hockey. If I'm gonna go with my predictions for the forwards, I think definitely gotta have Leon Draisaitl at the center. He won the heart. Uh, he won the heart and the heart Ross. You need to have him at the center position because he's he's a lock in my opinion. Um. And then I think right wing, personally, David Pashek would be my right wing. I could see them switching. Like, I don't think, honestly, like, if I'm being unbiased here, you can go with Kucherov. Um, you can go with Kane. I just think, personally, like, Pashek was tied for the most goals in the league. I think, honestly, he probably, like, for me, I'm biased. I'm going to always say Kane. But I think definitely Pashek, if I'm being unbiased. So, dry set up Pashnak. And obviously, for left wing, I think it's Panarin. It could be Ovechkin. I, I think, for me, my, my line would be... Uh, Panarin, Drysado, and Pashnak. I think that would be my best line for the forwards if we're talking about 2020, the regular season. Um, defense, we have Petrangelo, Makar, uh, Provov, Carlson, Klinberg, Shanker, Yossi, Quinn Hughes, Theodore, Hedman, Jones, and Suter. So now this one's tough because I feel like defensemen, it was a really good year for defensemen. Um, I think personally, if I had to choose, I think, man, I need Victor Hedman, bro. I think Victor Hedman definitely should be, um, on there, but, uh, uh, see for me personally like i don't know man I, I i really don't know it's tough i swear to god like i thought that there was mckinnon am i tripping i swear to god i thought that there was nathan mckinnon i don't know even even if there is a nathan mckinnon i think i don't know um i still think the best forwards are gonna be panarin dry subtle passionate you could go panarin dry subtle and maybe zabinajad can make that list too if you want to say he's a winger um it depends. They might even pull, like, Ovechkin. Like, I can see them doing, like, Ovechkin instead of, like, uh, Panarin or somebody or Pashnik because Ovechkin will sell no more packs. I can see them doing that. But defense is a bit more tough uh, because, man, there was a lot of good defense with this year. I think defense is it's really tough um, because of how good the defensemen were this season. There was a lot of good defensemen. Um, it, you know, in my opinion, I think... You know, Carlson was amazing. McCarr was amazing. Um, Yossi, Hedman, even, like, there's a lot of good defensemen this season. So, I, I think for sure I got to go with uh, Victor Hedman. Uh, I think I got to go Victor Hedman as one of my defensemen locks. And then I want to go with John Carlson because I feel like Carlson had a killer year. Um... I mean, more looking at it, I think John Klinberg had a good season, too. So defense is really tough. Like, I think if I had to cancel players, I would probably cancel Petrangelo, Promov, Shannon Kirk, um, Suter, Jones, Theodore, and Quinn Hughes. So it would probably be between Makar. I thought Makar had a really good year. Uh, Makar, Carlson, Klinberg, Yossi, Hedman. And then, honestly, like, I feel like I could cancel. Um, 
I don't know. It, it's tough. I'm not even going to say my defenseman, but if I had to choose, I think Victor Hedman, I want Victor Hedman to be on there because I love his card. And personally, Victor Hedman is probably my favorite defenseman in the league. So I want Hedman on there. And I, I think John Carlson, maybe. I think Yossi was really good this season. Um, are you, I, I think Yossi was decent. He didn't make the playoffs, though, which I, th I, I don't know. I don't know how to work this, but it's between them. But uh, that's uh, goal standing. We got Vasilevsky, Price, Hellebuck, Hart. Uh, I got to go with Andre Vasilevsky. Um, for me personally, goal is Vasilevsky. I got to go with Vasilevsky. Um, I don't know. I think Vasilevsky is probably my, my best bet. I mean, more I think of it, I, I think... Never mind. Actually, mm, Hellebuck did win Vesna. So, my nominees, my predictions is going to be uh, Panarin, Dreisaitl, Pashnak. And then I'm going a, I'm to a, I'm a go Hedman. And I'm going to go Roman Yossi because I feel like Roman Yossi was really good this season. And then I'm between Vasilevsky and Hellebuck. Hellebuck did win the Vezina Trophy. And honestly, like, Hellebuck did carry the Jets to the um, the, the the playing games. Um, they did lose against Calgary, though, but I feel like Hellebuck was really good. Um, I don't know. It's it's tough. Um, that's my picks. Um I, st I think defense is definitely the hardest position because you have guys like Hedman, Yossi, Carlson, who I think are three of the best defense. I think John Carlson had a great season. But tell me what you guys think about this. Obviously, um, I'm, I'm a bit shocked, man. I'm, I'm, I'm definitely a bit shocked that they did uh, do this Team of the Year thing. I don't know when this is coming out because, again, like I said, I, this is my first time. I barely played NHL 20, so it's my first time um, doing this. So drop a like, subscribe, catch you guys next video. Have a great, nice day. Peace out, boys.